just a pretty girl I'm going to do something I have wanted to film for a really really long time if you're a makeup lover you probably love nude lipsticks I know that I do anyone else finding the perfect nude lipstick for you is like I don't know finding gold finding a diamond you know like the one the one nude lipstick and it can be hard because there's so many out there and oh my god, god knows that I have many, many, so many nude lipsticks in my collection. Do you really need that many nude lipsticks? The answer is yes. Yes, you do. And even though every single one of them looks the same, they're all different. They're all unique in their own special way, okay? And especially if you are a pale girl like me, you know the struggle of finding a good nude lipstick. It's just really hard. You know what I'm saying? It's hard. It's hard, yeah. Because either it's too dark or it's too pasty or it washes you out, you know? So just finding a good nude lipstick when you're pale, that's a struggle. So in today's video, I am going to show you my favorite nude liquid lipsticks because liquid lipsticks are like my go-to. I don't use regular lipsticks that often anymore. If you want me to, I can definitely make a separate video where I talk about my favorite nude like normal lipsticks in a like tube. But for this video, I'm going to talk about my favorite liquid lipstick that are nude. I'm going to swatch them on my lips, on my hands, and yeah, show you close-ups and everything. So if you want to see that, then just keep on watching. So I'm going to start off with swatching my Anastasia Beverly Hills liquid lipsticks. I own three Anastasia liquid lipsticks and they're all nudes and they're all one of my favorite liquid lipsticks and favorite nude lipsticks. So I'm gonna swatch all three of them. I'm gonna start off with the shade Crush. So this is what Crush looks like on my lips. Crush is definitely the nude lipstick of the bunch that has a more color to it than just a plain nude. This has like a mauve, pinky, rosy tone to it, but I really, really like it because it's very muted, it's not too much, and it's still a nude. So yeah, that is Crush. Next up is Stripped Liquid Lipstick, also from Anastasia Beverly Hills. So this is what stripped looks like. It's a very nude, like this is a true nude lipstick. It's quite warm in the undertone, a little bit darker because, you know, here we're talking about pale skin and I have pale skin. So towards my fair skin, this is a little bit darker, not dark, but you know what I'm saying? It's darker, but it looks really, really beautiful. It looks just like just like the nude lipsticks that I like. I want them to be beige, oftentimes warmer, even though I have some cool tone nudes that I want to show you as well. And just like really like neutral beige. That's what I like. So I love this liquid lipstick. It's so beautiful. Last Anastasia liquid lipstick is in the shade Naked. Naked looks like this is my newest liquid lipstick in my collection so I have not worn this many many times but still I know Anastasia liquid lipsticks well enough because of the two other shades that are my favorite and has been for a while that I know that I really like this shade I don't need to wear it for a million times before I say that um, because I really really like Anastasia liquid lipstick in general I like their formula so that I already know and this shade is really a good nude for my skin tone. This is the palest one out of the three. It's like a paler version of Stripped, I would say, with a little bit more pink into it, but it's still a warm, beigey nude. 
just paler. And I really love this liquid lipstick. Next up is Malibu Liquid Lipstick from Kylie Cosmetics. So this is what Malibu Liquid Lipstick from Kylie Cosmetics looks like. This is definitely the darkest nude in this whole video that I'm going to show you. But this nude is so gorgeous. I have tried so many liquid lipsticks from Kylie. I have especially many of the mini ones. This is one out of two that I have in the big size. And I have no regrets of buying this in a full size. It's absolutely stunning. I have been using it a ton. And it's kind of unusual for me to love this kind of shade because it's cool toned. It's very like gray beige. Uh, it has a really gray undertone. But I really, really like it. And this is my absolute favorite color so far from Kylie. Kylie Cosmetics. Next up is Sao Paulo liquid lipstick from Ofra Cosmetics. This is what Sao Paulo looks like on the lips. This is also one of my newer favorites. I got this a couple of months ago. And that was the first time I tried out the Ofra liquid lipsticks. And I really, really like them. It's not my absolute favorite formula. That doesn't mean that I don't like the formula because I really, really do. It's just that I like some of the other formulas better because they last longer on my lips. But with that being said, this is one of the more comfortable formulas. But now we're talking about the shade and the shade is absolutely beautiful it's a beautiful nude it looks a little bit different on the lips than it does in the bottle and on my hand I feel like it looks a little bit more like beige like I like it I guess that you're seeing a theme here I like beigey warmer nudes this has a little bit more pink to it but not too much to where I don't like it <laughs> I really like this shade it's really beautiful and it goes with everything. Next up is Mannequin Velour Liquid Lipstick from Jeffree Star. So this is what Jeffree Star Velour Liquid Lipstick in Mannequin looks like. I love this nude and this liquid lipstick was the liquid lipstick that really made me fall in love with Jeffree's liquid lipsticks. I have two other ones. I never really fell in love with them like everyone else did but when I got this maybe like three months ago or so, oh my god. I fell in love. The nude color is absolutely stunning. The formula is really good. The applicator is really good. Packaging's cute, you know? So I feel like it suits me very well with my skin tone. This is like a very neutral nude. It's not warm, it's not cool. It's like right in the middle somewhere. And it's not really light, it's not really dark. It's in the middle somewhere as well. So yeah, I just really like this liquid lipstick. Um, so yeah. Last but not least, Too Faced Melted Matte Liquid Lipstick in the shade Child Star. So this is what the Too Faced Melted Matte Liquid Lipstick in Child Star looks like. And I gotta say, Too Faced Melted Mattes are my favorite liquid lipstick formula. They're the best. And as you can see, I have tried so many different formulas of liquid lipstick. These are not the only ones. I've also tried some other popular ones like ColourPop, Kat Von D. Formula-wise, Too Faced is the best in my opinion. But we're really here for the color and I absolutely love this nude. I actually have another nude liquid lipstick from Too Faced. What is it called? Cool girl. And even though it's really pretty and I use it, it's not up there with my favorites. This on the other hand, when I bought this and when I wore this for the first time, it was love at first sight. I felt like this was the perfect pale nude liquid lipstick for me. I love this. Uh, so if you're a pale girl like me, this is like... Mm, 
so good and that was all of them so I really really hope that you like this video I love all of these liquid lipsticks they're my babies you know what I'm saying they're my go-to's and I wear nude lipsticks like 95% of the time I love going for like a bolder or a darker lip sometimes but like for every day these are my homies you know what I'm saying these are my homies so and I got I just gotta add I love all of these formulas they're all different but I love all of them if I didn't I wouldn't have showed you these in this video so it's not only about the nude color it's of course about the formula as well so yeah I really hope that you like the video I really 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 want you to comment down below your favorite nude lipstick whether it's a liquid lipstick a regular lipstick what whatever like a lip gloss whatever just your favorite nude lip product let me know i would love to know if you like the video then click like subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos and i'll see you in my next one bye